Welcome back to the Tidwell Taste Store, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we're here with an, actually a Danish beer. Uh, it's not the first Danish product we've done, but it is the first Danish beer we've done. Uh, this is the it's Carlsberg. Interesting fact. We just did the Danish mead, remember? Yeah. Danish mead. Danish mead. Yeah. It's flavored with hibiscus. Ooh. Very nice. I was talking about that. Okay, right. so. <laughs> this is the Carlsberg Elephant. Carlsberg is one of the biggest breweries uh, in the world, actually. Their elephant is 7.2% alcohol by volume, very strong lager, very popular. I don't know if that's where its name comes from, but I know it's very popular in the African countries of, uh, well, most of Sub Saharan Africa. So let's check it out. Yeah, I feel like it was in a movie as well, like some movie with like a band and they're all drinking Carlsberg. Could be. I do wonder where the name comes from, actually. I, I'm, I should have researched that before we did this video. Is there a place? Eh? Is it a place? I don't want to visit. <laughs> not a Carl, Carlsberg name? <laughs> no, not, not Carlsberg, Elephant. The oh. Elephant. I wonder why they oh, call this one Elephant. Oh. Is it popular in Africa? I think it's because it's, it's, I don't maybe, know. Maybe it's heavy on flavor. Heavy yeah. on flavor? Well, it's because it's, it's, it's heavier than their normal. Mmm. Ooh, very. Mmm. Not bad. I kind of like that. A little cheap tasting, <laughs> but not bad. Seven point two percent alcohol. Um, it's it's um slightly sweeter. Um, as I kind of imagined it would be, being a strong lager like that. It's still not sweet like the, some of the real cheap malt liquors and stuff like that. But it's slightly sweeter. It is malty. Mm -hmm. It's it's pretty good. I, I like yeah, it. If, it. If you're gonna be listening to like Colony or Horacle, maybe, but not uh, if you're listening to like. Reroute, I'd go for a different beer. Yeah, I wouldn't do this one. Yeah, it's got that. Again, I don't know the proper term, the skunkiness that that, and you know, a Heineken sort of. It, it kind of reminds me of that. Is that a right, particular right. method that? I feel like it's the green bottle. Probably the green bottle. I feel like it's it's actually getting skunked in the. Beer. I've had Heineken draft in the Netherlands, and I can tell you right now, it doesn't taste skunky one bit. Okay, so well, that's okay. So. The green bottle. It's not a bad flavor. In fact, it's sort of a particular beer flavor that, that I get. It's just that it, this does have that. So it must be green bottle. Yeah, I I kind of like it, man. Do you? I like, I like like the, the for some reason, the lagers that are in like the 7% range. Really? It tastes really good to me, like the Polish ones. Well, you remember the one, that, the one that we did that was uh, the Indian, Hayward's 5000, actually. The one that was... I For some reason, I really like lagers in like the 7% range. Huh. It's very strange. Normally I don't. Um, this one is better than most of them I have in that range. I do like it, but it's not my favorite thing in the world. I think it's deserving of a six. It does have an interesting sweetness on the back. Yeah. The back end. Is that, you say that's typical of a heavy? It's typical of a lager that heavy is lager. roughly the same price range as a regular lager, but it's stronger. Hmm. They just use more more fermenting sugars and things like that. So more Higher residual. Sugar level. Okay. Yeah. I gotcha. Um... Yeah, I go. Yeah, you may. I'm, I'm thinking 6.5 for me. Okay. Uh, above average, pretty damn good. I like it. I could see myself having a couple pints. Me too. In a pub somewhere. And, and I agree with him. I gave it a 6, but it is above average for what it is. I do yeah. like the beer. I'm going to give it a 7. Cool. I like it. Okay. I think it's good. Solid. So in closing, the Carlsberg Elephant. Kind of sweet. Kind of unique for a strong lager, but has that strong lagery flavor as well. Malty, but... Uh, yeah, that's pretty much that, right, guys? Yeah, man. All right. Good. 6.0, nice. 6.5, 7.0. This is the Carlsberg Elephant from Denmark. 7.2% alcohol by volume. The Taste Tour will return. We thank you for joining us. And stick around and view some more of our videos. <laughs> yeah, do that. Thank you.